Ciao a tutti amici e bentornati sul mio canale, io sono Andreas. Oggi continuiamo la nostra avventura con il terzo episodio del terzo capitolo di Ritorno al Futuro. Dunque, allora ci hanno ammonito per quanto riguarda uh, l'alcol, la fiaschetta che avevamo addosso. Quindi ci manca di uh, essere ammoniti per quanto riguarda gli animali randaggi e per quanto riguarda... <coughs> uh, le manifestazioni di affetto in luogo pubblico diciamo così quindi vediamo un po' poi abbiamo anche la chitarra vediamo un po' Jenny per se ci dice qualcosa di nuovo entrando là però la cassetta militare vediamo se l'ha lasciata wow. aperta no? Ti ho menzionato che i dogi sono lungo da Hill Valley, ma non posso pensare che hanno catturato ogni stagione. Allora, vediamo un po'. 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 Vediamo un po' Was that Jennifer? Well, A, it's none of your business, and B, seeing as she ain't your chick no more? Yeah. Okay, now this timeline is really pissing me off. You and Jennifer? You and Jennifer? Really? Oh, is the poor little nerd jealous? Well, yeah, and a little disgusted. That's probably the soup. Uh, trust the and Jennifer. You better treat Jen with respect, Leech. Hey, I got nothing but respect for Jennifer. Respect for her eyes, for her hips, the way she wriggles when she... Hey! Now, that dork that let her get away, there's a loser that I got no respect for. Uh, come va con gli starnuti? Cosa c'è nel menu? Assaggi gratuiti. Vediamo un po'. Come va con gli starnuti? You got a cold or something? Ugh. Allergies. I swear there's a dog hanging out around here somewhere. A dog? Yeah. And the stupid mutt keeps trying to steal my free samples. You sure there's a dog around here? Listen, smart boy. There's only two things I'm allergic to. Dogs and disco. And I don't hear no chicka bow wow. Do you? No. Then it's a dog. What's on the menu? Soup. Just soup? And more. Altro. Falls under the more category. We got neat loaf. It's made with textured wheat protein. Uh, no thanks. What soup kind of soup you got? Uh, scrolle... Rivellini? Yeah, that's right. Some things never change. Quanto's what altro? else falls under the more category? Well, there's the hum burger. It's made from pressed roasted hummus. You have any real meat back there? Define real. I'm afraid to ask, but what other non-soup food do you have? Anything edible? Well, we have these pea and liver with soy cheese hot dogs. They're new, and we're offering free samples. You want one? Perfetto, prendiamo le assaggi gratuiti, magari riusciamo a tirare il cane, vediamo un po'. Oh, God. Sai che devo essere molto schifo questo. Non è il mio problema. Vediamo cosa sono. Cosa sono queste cose? Queste sono le liver e le pezze con soia e cheese hot dogs. Tu e io, brown noser. Why are the samples behind the counter? I can't leave them out, dude. There's a DOG running around town, and he keeps going after the sample tray, knocking them all over the ground. A dog? Wait, these samples haven't been on the ground, have they? Jeez, McFly, relax. They're fresh, mostly. About this dog, what's he look like? Beats me. He's a smart little SOB. He only comes around when my back is turned. Then how do you know it's a dog? You can smell him? Allergies, dimwit.
Ok, quindi abbiamo finito di parlare sì. con lui. Smell you later. Allora, dice che se uh, ci si allontana, arriva il cane, infatti. Hey, hey, there's that mangy. Uh, go get him, McFly. Ed è Einstein. Ah, è andato di là. Lei ha lasciato qui le bambolette, perfetto. Allora, vediamo un po'. Magari ci serve tanto anche gli aiuti, cosa ci dicono? Mi segui il cane, vero? Ovunque vada il cane puoi seguirlo, più o meno. Prova a interagire con gli ostacoli su cui potrebbe essere salito o nascosto. Quindi è salito sulla... Ehm, come si dice? Su quella lì. Dovrai seguire il cane fino al suo nascondiglio nel vicolo, oltre quell'asso di legno. Infatti... He's got to be hiding in here somewhere. I bet you're under here. Not a sign of him. C'è sfuggito. Allora, per correre dietro non di sicuro non ce la facciamo. <coughs> E infatti non è un cane è troppo intelligente, o troppo veloce. Se solo il cane lasciasse delle tracce non dovessi tirare a indovinare dove si nasconde. Vernice fresca. Prova a usare la vernice spray di Jenny, perché abbiamo già raccolto prima la bomboletta spray, sull'asse di legno, su cui il cane passa sempre. Ah, ecco. Così lascia le impronte. It would look better blue. Allora, allontan allontaniamoci così, magari ritorna. Nella, suo, nella sua casa, nella sua cuccia. Infatti è passato dietro di noi. Eccolo là. Now we're in business. E infatti è qua dietro. Vediamo un po'. I outsmarted you, didn't I? Ah, oh, don't be like that, Aini. Allora, mi sa che adesso dobbiamo dargli il bocconcino, perché è questo, per farci l'amico. Look, Aini, I've got a treat for you. Atta boy, now hold still. See, I'm not such a bad guy, right? <laughs> whoa, whoa, okay. I guess I've won you over. I wish they were all this easy. E con così, eh, in giro con il cane dovremmo infrangere il secondo. Einstein, wait. No. Avere la seconda munizione. <coughs> Infatti corre dietro lei perché ce l'ha sempre avuto con lei. Einstein, sit! Einstein? Oh, se he bites me, you'll be in a world of trouble, citizen! Wait, I know that creature. Officer Parker, that's the stray that keeps escaping the kennel. I thought he was muzzled. I took the muzzle off. You what? That's right, he's my dog now. Citizen, you are in violation of statute 357K. Parker, demerit this hooligan at once. I'll return this creature to the kennel. Yes, ma'am. Filthy, wretched beast. Don't worry, Einie. Once I fix all this, you'll be back with Doc and romping through time. Now stay out of trouble, unless you want a visit from Citizen Brown. 
Ok, mi faccio qualche regola e provo a rimetterti con Jennifer uh, e yeah, a limonare in pubblico. Cominciare a limonare è eh, stesso. Ok, quindi dobbiamo tornare a Jennifer. Vedere cosa ci dice. Uh, you with team. Leech, Jennifer? Hey, don't badmouth Leech. There's a lot more to him than soup, you know. Like what? For one thing, he wields an axe like nobody's business. Anche noi ci impegniamo a chitarra e siamo dei rocchettari. So you got yourself a new guitar player. What can I say? I'm a girl who appreciates a hot lick. Yeah, I remember. Come on, Jennifer. Nobody in town plays guitar like me. I'm talking electric guitar, Martin. I'm going to be honest, the ukulele has to go. I can outplay your loser boyfriend any day of the week. You're that desperate to get to first base. Did you say first or fourth? I'd give you two and a half. But first you got to prove you've got better fingers than Leech. You ready to throw down? I was born ready. You got a guitar? Never leave home without it. Hold on. Ah, quindi dobbiamo sfidare il tipo. You can knock on my door and <coughs> hold it, we got company. <coughs> right. What's that was doing here? He says he can outplay you. I told him there's no one in Hill Valley better than you. Wanna go prove it? The ring of rock. Don't crush him too bad. Just teach him a lesson. Allora. Forbicciata, mini assolo, arrenditi non di sicuro, uh, forbicciato, grande, allora vai verso l'amplificatore, mini assolo, solo renditi sali sulla piattaforma allora lui fa le stesse cose che facciamo noi però lui ha quest'assa qua e noi non ce l'abbiamo perché il nostro bidone del rudo è chiuso quindi proviamo a fare sali sulla piattaforma e infatti Allora. Vai verso l'amplificatore. Vai verso Jennifer. Allora, dobbiamo trovare un sistema in modo tale che lui resti sopra. Quindi... Eh, 
Niente era ancora, sali sulla piattaforma. Eh, bisogna vedere se poi lui ci rimane su. Yes. Quindi direi salta. Perfetto. Martin McFly. That was that was that was totally awesome. What can I say? Some guys got it and some guys don't. You broke my head, Stock. I think I've got a new idol. Come here. Wait, I got a better idea. What was it you called me? A square? A girl's entitled to make a mistake, isn't she? Oh. Mm. Mm. Oh. Ah, dietro mm. c'è la vecchia. Vediamo se. Ecco. Oh, si facciano. I just caught these sì, two degenerates violating statute number Jennifer? Daddy, 476 D. Open mouths? And tongues. You've gone too far, Jennifer. <sighs> What's the big deal? It's only hormones. Stop! We don't use words like that in this town. I'll deal with you later, young lady. We're gonna have to have a long talk about the Citizen Plus program. What? Oh, come on. Officer, give Mr. McFly a full 76 D's worth of demerits. I'll tend to your wayward yes, daughter. Yes, ma'am. And this is for getting my daughter in trouble with Citizen Edna. Now keep out of trouble, or Citizen Brown will come down on you like a brick wall. Ok, quindi abbiamo infranto McFly. tutti e tre i... Uh, abbiamo preso tutti e tre le munizioni. Hey Jennifer, are you still angry with me? Angry? Nah. The threat of being Citizen Plus was worth it just to see my dad's veins go all purple like that. Great, because I gotta go. Geez, Martin, what's gotten into you? Booze, dogs, necking in public? It's like you're a different guy today. A way cooler guy. I know this is gonna be hard to believe, but I'm the same guy I've always been. It's everyone else who's messed up. And stop calling me Martin, it's Marty. Well, Marty. What's next on the agenda? Knocking over banks? Maybe. What's a guy got to do to get in trouble around here? Uh, I think you're about to find out. You, citizen. Get out of here, Jen. Not a problem. Are you Martin Seamus McFly? Yes. We have a warrant for your detention. Uh, detention? We've accrued over 15,000 demerits in the past 24 hours. Cool. Is it, young Mr. McFly? is being branded as a criminal of weak moral character cool i'm not weak but you are in a heap of trouble trouble oh my yes but don't worry we're here to take care of you like your citizen plus program took care of biff perhaps the program is in need of new volunteers but let's not get ahead of ourselves First, let's see what Citizen Brown has to say about your particular strain of antisocial behavior. You're taking me to Citizen Brown? Immediately. Officers, away with him. Yes, yes ma'am. Quindi riusciamo ad andare a parlare con Doc. I always knew your goody two shoes A plus student act was too good to be true. Come in, citizen. Martin McFly, age 18, resident of Sector L, Father George, Lorraine, president of Junior Brown Brigade. Recipient of a full ride scholarship to Strickland College. Winner of the courthouse challenge to former war. Zero demerits until this morning. The obvious question, Mr. McFly, is... What happened to you? 
Uh, could you just for that? Jesus Christ, Doc, what happened to you? Doc, interesting. You regard me as a doctor, indicating awareness that you're suffering from some variety of mental disorder. That's a hopeful sign, Martin. Of course, I'm not actually a doctor, but I do have the tools to turn you around and put you back on the road to societal normalization. Shall we begin with a few questions to establish a baseline? Forget questions. You're the one who needs to turn around. Explain. Il pale non dovrebbe essere così. Tu non dovresti essere così. Non dovrebbe essere in questa linea temporale. I know this is going to be hard for you to swallow, Doc, but I'm not from around here. I'm from a different timeline where Hill Valley isn't all screwed up and there aren't these crazy rules and, and my dad's not a snoop and my mom's not a drunk and, and you're my best friend in the whole space-time continuum. An old foggy like me? Your best friend? Yes! And Doc, I need you to get me back there. So you believe this interview is really more about me than you? Yes! You went to all this trouble just to deliver a message to me in person? Yes! A cry for help, as it were. Yes! No, wait. Tell me, Martin. Is your mother on the sauce again? Lascia fare mamma non... Non da dove provengo. Lascia mamma fare... Forget my mother. She's not the issue here. Don't ever forget your mother, Martin. Your parents are your superiors, and respect for one's superiors is absolutely essential to the Hill Valley Order. I'm surprised your father hasn't set you straight on this point. He's shown himself to be a very obedient and cooperative citizen. Allora, intendi un cittadino degenerato, lascia mio padre fuori da tutto ciò. Quello non è il papà che conosco. Lascia mio padre fuori da tutto ciò. Leave my dad out of it, okay? Let's focus on you and your time machine. Time machine? Yeah, Doc, listen to me. You don't remember it, but you built a time machine out of a DeLorean. Why? Commando stupido, perché? Perché? Well, just for the hell of it, I, I guess. Plus, the steel frame of the DeLorean dispersal, I don't know. But it was important for some reason. Fascinating. Yes! Yes, it is fascinating. It's it's amazing. It's incredible. But you don't know it because you've never invented it. You're not the real Doc Brown. You gotta believe me. And this is because? Everything got screwed up when I went back in time to 1931. Sounds like this time machine is a very impractical and dangerous invention. Yes, I, I mean, no. What I mean is it's messed up a lot of things, but first, it made a lot of things better. Uh, like my mom and my dad. It was only thanks to your time machine that they ever became successful and happy. So they're happy. But they're not, because you summoned me back in time and somehow your timeline got messed up and everybody else is along with it. I see. No, you don't. Think, think back. Don't you remember me? We knew each other when you were 18. I'm Michael Corleone. Incredible. Hmm. This case is more serious than I'd imagined. The boy has fabricated an alternate reality. Uh, questa è la realtà alternativa. Pensi che io sia pazzo? Vorrei che fosse così semplice. <coughs> no, <coughs> this is the alternate reality. My reality is the real reality. Calm down, Martin. I'm not blaming you for anything. The failure is ours, not yours. Obviously, there was a drastic flaw in your social conditioning. Yeah, you don't understand. No, I don't understand yet, but I want to. I want to get at the root of your problem. Keep talking. Yeah, uh, oh, uh, uh. Uh. Take your time. Look around the room. Perhaps something here will stimulate your not your memory. Convince Cittadina ad aiutarti. Ok. Ma questo lo vediamo prossimamente. Ragazzi, io direi che il terzo episodio finisce qui. Se vi è piaciuta la nostra avventura, se vi sta piacendo, lasciate un bel like e commentate e iscrivetevi al canale. Vi ringrazio per avermi seguito, ci vediamo con il prossimo gameplay. Un saluto a tutti da Gamer 78